Okay, so I got my BoxyCharm box, my box Premium box. Um, I didn't really have time to get ready this morning because I had a dentist appointment at 7 a.m. because I have to do it before the kids get up because, you know, yay me. So anyway, so I got my BoxyCharm box. I knew it was coming today, so I just kind of waited anyway because I wanted to use this, um, the Picate party palette that came. Um, it's prettier than I thought. And in the meantime, in waiting for the box, I ordered their, um, They've got a, a a palette that's a like more of like a grunge '90s palette. Anyway, so while I was waiting, I um, ordered that, and that one's cool. But I definitely um, like the colors are so pretty. Anyway, I'm totally digging it. I don't think you can really appreciate it unless you see it in person. At least I don't feel like I did anyway. Um, okay, so then I looked this up. What is the brand? Fuck I. A-C-C-I-A. -A. Anyway, there's a bunch of tea being spilt over it's being, you know, $100 um, listed as a $100 moisturizer. Um, the fact that there's, somebody did some research, I found a Reddit thing about how, um, like what the ingredients were the most, um, there was like really nothing that was too concerning um, other than the fact that they used butane instead of the alternative, since this isn't an aerosol thing. Um, but it just kind of it's, I don't know, haven't tried it yet. We'll see. I don't know. Um, but anyway, hadn't heard of these people before. I was still excited to try it. I mean, where else am I going to get this much product for like this much? I mean, I would have paid this much for one item. So I figured no matter what, it's a good deal. If I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't. Whatever. Move on. So this right here, the Glow Recipe Watermelon um, Glow Ultra Fine Mist. This I'm excited about. I did, um, I have the, the moisturizer and I do like that. And I, I did read, um, not read, I watched a video. Um, and I might've read some on Reddit too, but if you put it in your windowsill, it like changes the color and the composition. So not a good idea. Um, but I am happy that this was in there. It says it's 85% watermelon. And so it's really good for your skin. I know when I was, um, pregnant with, um, uh, with my second child, I ate a lot of watermelon because I was dehydrated all the time. So if you have dry skin, I, but this is really good for it. Anyway, it's pretty. It's still separated. And I like to leave it that way. Satisfaction. So, um, the Hourglass, um, ambient blush. I got diffused heat. So mine's a little more pink. I don't usually do too much in pink, but I did just get the, um, a couple other palettes. So, uh, anyway... I'm going to try this out and, and see where I can get it, get it to get in where it fits in with some color scheme or another, um, <clears throat> as revealed, uh, and all the, you know, things, uh, saying we were going to get it because we did, but, um, Tarte Double Duty Beauty, um, primer, um, it says it's got a really high moisture content and, um, I know if I'm going to go and put something on that's got some coverage like this. Becca Cosmetics stuff that I just got that's like super thick and smells like lacquer. I should probably go ahead and put something on that's going to protect my face since, since you know, if it smells like that, you know, it's going to stick for as long as it's going to basically until you take it off. You probably want to put something as protection over your face. Anyway, I mean, I guess the Becca would have came in this month's box. If I would have actually got it in this month's box, it would have been in my base box instead of the, um, the other oil that I got. So they would have came together because they need to. Last but not least, I got the Citrus Guava Body Butter and um, lotion. I mean, I'm all about lotion, so I uh, definitely don't mind that one. I didn't see what it smells like yet. Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah, that's good. And it's huge. I mean, it's like eight ounces. So, I mean, it'll, and it's, it's, it's body butter. So it's not lotion. So, I mean, it'll last a minute. Anyway, um, my value for my box, that was my third, so this is my $35 box, um, is like two fifty, two sixty, two sixty. 260, um, you know, and I just, I kind of wonder if there's a, um, cosmetics company that I found when I was looking that was like uh called Bella and then like the same name and it, it kind of makes me wonder if maybe that's like a an up-and-coming place like maybe that's like I don't know 
I don't know if maybe that's the same company or what, or if maybe I would assume if Boxy had this made special like for them, they would put their name on it. Anyway, uh, I don't really get into the whole spilling of the tea of it. I'll just use it and see if I like it. But anyway, that's kind of like, I'm kind of interested now. Like I want to know, like why, why is this a mystery product? Um, anyway, but, uh, I'm sure at some point, considering I'm not the only one who's, um, wondering now since I looked it up, um, what's up? I'm sure we'll all find out sooner or later. All right. Have a good day.